And we're back with the boys 3200 meter run here in class 1A as they're off. Some of the favorites in here today are Eric Baugh, ran a 9.13 two mile earlier this year at the Eastern Relays. Matthew Bodie, of course, ran a two mile as well, 9.27 earlier at the Eastern Relays. This is your matchup in cross. Bodie and Eric Baugh fought hard. Bodie winning the cross title in November. Eric Baugh. And they're up, both up front, Bodie, them, Eric Baugh, Aaron Weir in there to, as well, leading that little chase pack. Bodie ran 9.27 earlier this year, his fastest time ever. He is a national caliber swimmer, so this is not his first choice of sport, but still loves it and still a state champion, so an incredible athlete. Eric Baugh, one of the top distance runners. In Kentucky, looks like that's Adam Huff making a move up to catch up to the chase or the leaders. Adam Huff has a seed time of 10:15. Believe he's ran uh, just under sub 10 earlier this year. So they come through the first lap and around a 70-71. Still a huge pack, but that's bound to change as we go later in the day. Matthew Bodie, Eric Baugh, Adam Huff, Aaron Weir. Baugh won the mile and the 800 already today. He did this last year and finished around 8th, 7th or 8th in the 2 mile. We'll see if he can do a little bit better of a triple this year. An outstanding runner from Villa Madonna. We have someone trying to catch the chase pack. Or the front pack, excuse me. We'll get that runner's name in a minute. Bodie, Baugh, Huff, Tyler McCauley trying to get up there with the leaders. You see, they've started to spread out into a couple of packs right now. We yeah, have some run, uh, runners from Bishop Rosser, Nick Schuler, and Ross Clock and Kemper. Collie's backed off that chase pack or the front pack. They've started to separate themselves a little bit. Bodie, Ball, and Huff. Ball, a commit of Butler University. Going to be running there next year. Bodie committed to Davidson. He'll be swimming there next year. Adam Huff, a little bit younger, just a sophomore. But running with the big guys right now. Some of the fastest in the state of Kentucky. You can see they've really opened up on this last lap, their lead. Going out pretty hard. You have McCauley, Warner, Clock from Bishop Rossert. Running into that little chase pack. Garrett, Garrett Faulkner as well in the middle of that chase pack. Fourth place from Newport Catholic, Ryan Anderson. Third place. Really opened up a lead. Logan Campbell. I'd say about 50 meter lead for that first group. We'll see how long these guys can hang on. Bodie just leading up front, looking strong, relaxed. Eric Baugh comfortable just hanging right on him. If it turns out to whoever has the most speed, it'll be Baugh, but we'll just see. Bodie's got a lot of endurance with that swimming and running combo. Adam Huff looking strong as well. He's not giving up on this first group yet. He's got a big lead right now. They have a huge lead on that second pack. McCauley's been drawn in by the chase pack. They're moving. Eric Bodie has just a little bit of an extra step. Bodie ran the 4 by 8 earlier today, but that's his only other event. They come through the mile in 452. 
51-7. Ball's a little bit, uh, a little bit more fatigued, winning the 1600 and 800. And you can see right now, Bodie opening up his lead. Has a made a pretty big gap there in the last 100 to 200 meters. So Ball and Huff in second and third fighting for that. Bodie really opened up his lead. Clog and Kepper and Ward <coughs> leading that chase back still. Faulkner up there. Faulkner got fourth in the mile earlier today. Running at a 4.34, I believe, so we'll see what he has left in this two mile. Bodie taking command after the mile marker. Adam Huff has made the move past Ball. Ball is really showing the fatigue from winning the first two events, 1600 and 800. But he's still holding on to third right now. Not completely out of second. Bodie right there through it. Adam Huff running really well right now. Eric Ball, third. Clocky from Bishop Rossert is your fourth place runner. He's opened up a little bit of a lead on that chase pack. So he's strung out a little bit. Warren, another Bishop Rossert. Garrett Faulkner from Williamsburg. Still some of your leaders. You see the rest of the field coming through right there. They pan back to the other side of the track. Matthew Bodie still running strong, looking smooth. Doesn't look like he's working that hard right now. He's really opened up a gap. Looking comfortable. Adam Huff really has a pretty pretty good sized lead on Eric Ball right now, sitting in second. Eric Ball in third. Ross Cluck, Clucky from Bishop Rossert starting to gain a little bit on Ball, slowly but surely. And that chase back's not giving up yet. Of Schuler, Warren, and Faulkner. Matthew Bodie has a huge lead on the rest of the field right now. Adam Huff there down the back stretch. About 100 meters back from Bodie, but he's got about a 40 meter lead on Ball. Ball's got a lot of speed. Don't count him out of the second spot yet. Eighth place for Murray. Fourth place. They're all pretty strung out along the track. About even spaces of 40, 50 meters. That is Ross Clock on the back stretch, sitting in fourth. There's the chase pack going after him. Warren's made the move to, fur, uh, to the front of that chase pack. And with the bell lap, we have Matthew Bodie making a move, passing people, trying not to get boxed in by some of the other runners. Matthew Bodie making his kick. He's got 300 meters left. He's at 8.48 with 300 to go. Matthew Bodie out there. Got almost 200 to go now. Adam Huff, Eric Ball, just getting on their last lap. Matthew Bodie, runner up last year. Won state cross country this past year. One of the top distance runners in Kentucky. Finishing very strong here. In his last track race, Matthew Bodie. Finishing strong, coming down the back stretch. He's going to be your 1A state champion in the two mile. Matthew Bodie with a 9.33. 9.33 for Matthew Bodie. Finishing very strong. As we try to pan back to second place. Adam Huff coming down the back stretch. 
Finishing strong, he's gonna be your runner up here in 1A. Running very well today. It's tough, 10 one Eric Baugh. Clock coming in strong, but Eric Baugh holds him off for third. Fourth place right there, Warren getting fifth. Garrett Faulkner, Williamsburg coming in, finishing sixth. Or fifth, excuse me. Sixth. Oops, sixth. Fisher Brosser with another scorer here in the boys' 3,200-meter run. 1A. See some of the other finishers finishing strong still. Time of the boys around 10.45. Wagner, we'll go to the board in a minute to see your official times. Enrique Ellery, those gentlemen, please report to the awards area for the boys. 300 meter hurdle. Going to the board. Bodie with a 9.32. Huff, 30 seconds back with a 10.01. Ball, third with 10.09. There's your boys, 3,200 meter run, class 1A here at the Kentucky State Track and Field Championships. This is Grayson Brookshire, and joining me is Clay Dixon. Call for the 